Hello and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 Cagliari. So, last time we got all of our men together for an attack on Poland. Same war. We got the whole Kingdom of Germany under our control. And we are looking at new possibilities. We also have an adventurer threat attacking us, so... We need to worry about that, maybe, if he ever actually appears on the map. I'm scouring the map looking for... Oh, is it down here? Raiders? No. What's this flag? The triple dots? Oh, I could... I can go to his character page here. It should tell me where he is. He's nowhere. We've got an invisible adventurer. Oh no, so I can't, uh, a small baron's trying to get a claim on my territory? Oh no. I'm, I'm sure he'll use that. Right, these are really easy to assault because uh, we've already assaulted them, followed by the Polish assaulting them, so let's take that, go to the next place. Actually, we probably want to attack into Brandenburg if we can. What's the... Major River Elb 2 everywhere. River flows between Lubez and here. But Louts. Louts is fine. Yeah, we do that. Uh. Oh, right. This saying that somebody else is in charge of something in Ra. I don't suppose you want to join my plot. No, he really likes the king. It's going to be very difficult to kill that king. We should probably double check whether there's a thing he, uh, whether more people want to join. No? What was this? Is that the host? It's a different host. Oh, there's the host. It's over here. So we'll try and attack Poland. I think we're going to miss out just slightly. He's leaving on the 5th. We're arriving on 13th. Okay. We'll go kill the hosts over here. We'll head in through like that to get to. Royal marriage between Adriana and Sultan of Arabia. Okay. Don't know why you want to marry her, but that's fine. A merchant managed to find out the coins you melted were, minted were a bit shady and didn't contain the metals they were supposed to consist of. People might taunt my face on those coins now. Lose a small amount of prestige. We have 7,000 prestige though. It's really just not an issue. Yeah, he has one flank. Again, adventurers are super easy. And the next adventurer then attacked in to me. Oh, perfect. And we can go kill both of them in this province here. And then we'll just go kill the last group. We've got some rebels in Benghazi. Oh, we, we slew somebody? Okay. And continue attacking. Perfect. Where are you going? You are going to Osterfriesland. Well, we'll attack in there. Perfect. 100%. Force demands. He is now our prisoner. What can we do to him? Banish him for 400 gold? Deal. We'll head back over to Poland now. Okay. We have almost three times as men as this guy in Poland. He does get his defensive bonus. But we have almost three times as men. As long as we don't attack through the wrong bit. So, if we attack through like this, we should do absolutely fine in killing his entire army. He's assaulting down. Oh, he's trying, he's trying to run. Where's he going? Not a mice? Little Mice has a river between where he is. Do you want to go to Laos? Perfect. We'll attack like this. Yes. Cut his army. 
We go into Volslav. Go in here. Call an allies to the Holy War for Sisla. Okay. Call them again. Kill them. We got a uh, Baron as a prisoner. That's good. We can send him away for a small amount of gold. Execute the rest because we don't need them. Okay. Let's head into the previously sieged province. Don't suppose he just uh, wants to surrender now. Untouched lands and hold It's okay. Uh, give King a chance. Hopefully the other guy will get die before that becomes an issue. How's this army doing in reinforcing? Fairly well. Okay. Well, once it reinforces, we'll start making money again. Being the important bit, I think. Okay, top level. Let's continue assaulting. Lots of attack. Polish conquest of Stettin ended. Rush, Rus lost. Okay, fine. Ninety-four percent. You want to surrender now? Untouched lands, untouched armies and holdings. Well, we'll go to the next place and attack it. And he will surrender now. Three thousand men as a group. Well, let's just go kill his army. Hopefully, that'll do enough. Okay. Killed his army. Let's see. We're going to be told that you, you have untouched that. Oh, he's got more army. Okay. Mastermind Theologian. Okay, not very interested. So he's going to arrive on the 12th. So on the 11th, we'll start moving to Lower Sis. Right, we'll, we'll grab his army. I think if we kill it all... He, yeah, right, 100%. Finally, we have finished the War of the Polish. Good. Ooh. Let's just start giving it away now. Okay, so we're giving away all of these ones. We've got some people who were obviously Catholic, I guess. Yeah, okay. So we get, we get to just keep them. And find characters. Let's go for intrigue this time. Intrigue this time. Oh, I don't have a scroll bar anymore in this one because I only controlled Constantinople. Okay, did that actually give it away? Um, okay. I may or may not have given that land away. I did not give that land away. I think I clicked underneath it. And we will give him the county of Opal. Oh, I should have checked whether I could actually take any... I can't take the chiefdom. Oh no. I'm way over the vassal limit. I forgot what the penalty for that is. Does that mean they just don't... They don't give us taxes? Oh. Oh no. I might just need to put it all under Bohemia. I think that's my only answer. Yeah, I think I just need to put them all under Bohemia. Hmm. It was a bad move. Not checking whether I could uh, actually give them away. Transfer vassalage, and we'll stick you under Bohemia as well. Good. That makes Bohemia look a little bit stronger as well. Hopefully he'll go press some claims. How is our plot doing over here? Oh, not so well, but somebody else will join it now. Okay. No, he won't join. Okay, that's that's annoying me. This bug is back. Uh, let's send some of these people back for some gold. Execute you, though. So we got a fully reinforced army over here, ready to fight. 
Let's have a look at Carpathia. So, ideally, we'd like to grab Hungary from there. Hungary would be a very good one, because that's the land that he controls himself. Oh, he doesn't control Hungary himself. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought he did. He only controls the center of Hungary. Pest. Let's see if we can get some... Let's see. Claimants to the Kingdom of Hungary. He would not join, but why wouldn't he join? Um, it's, not, it's not telling me. If I send him a gift, would he join? No. Likes the guy too much. Okay. Let's have a look at other kingdoms underneath Hungary. Sarkel? We're quite close to that, actually. Here? That's only a duchy. That is some duchy. Let's hope there's some claimants to it. Aha! Uh -huh. We have a claim. Is it a strong claim, though? No. No strong claims. Okay, so that won't work. Crimea. Do we have somebody with a claim? Strong claim on the Duchy of Crimea. Perfect. We could grab that. It's not really crippling enough, though. We need some kingdoms in here. Is there maybe a way that we can... Okay, I was seeing whether there were any claimants to kingdoms that didn't exist. I don't suppose that's going to happen. Hmm. We just have to wait till something pops up. The Byzantines are so fractured... Like, does he even have a kingdom underneath him? I don't think he does. Uh, how would I fit vassals? There it is. He has one ki- Oh, the Ecumenical Patriarch. Yes. We No claimants to that. Okay. So, that's not great. Uh... Yeah, they're all duchies underneath them. What is it with these guys and never having a king underneath them? Russ ha may have a king, but it's so far away that we take so much attrition getting there. I don't really want to attack Russ. Turkestan might be a good target for just now. I don't really want to attack it because we'll get Mongol invasions and things. But Maybe I want to just go down to India and just take lots of land down here. That could work. Um, for now, I'll send this army along here and just take uh, easy to fight places. So We've raised army levies? Oh, over in Poland. Let's get rid of them. Fine. Leave them to reinforce. Now we can attack, right? Right, well, let's clear war for... There, and we'll just run over. We can call allies in, but I mean, it makes absolutely no difference. I think we'll take that, then we'll take Mary. Then maybe... And Zyrene? Mary, Zyrene, Zamora. We'll take all of these, just in little bits. And hopefully we'll have a new plan by then. Hmm. Don't suppose that there's like a claimant to Denmark that would join. Ah, uh, no. I kind of want to stop these raiders. It might be worth going in. Wait, how did the Byzantines get land in Northumberland? I'm not entirely sure. So, Duchy of Nikita now includes that, but who controls this land? Like, who is your... Are these single county... So, he went and conquered Britain. Interesting. Anyway, I want to stop these raiders. So, how would it... 
guess the only thing I can do is attack Denmark to stop them. Can I attack them right now? Oh, I have a truce with them. Oh. I could attack England. They are... They are currently Germanic. Yeah, okay, I'll attack England. Take a bit of land from them. Maybe. I see all these... Oh, they're all Catholic. That's a pain, because it'll take a while to get them all down. I kind of want to just reduce our raider problem though because if we stop having raiders we'll make more money because we'll stop stealing it during the last year or so your daughter Valina has been spending a lot of time with the members of the local monastic order you've also noticed she spends many hours per week in pious prayer then one day she approaches you asking your permission to dedicate her life to Christ Sure, why not? Whatever. She don't, you don't have any claims. You're not actually that important. Okay, so there's a Germanic uprising for us. That means we're less likely to get this plot happening, I think. Yeah. Because they'll like them more. Let's not help them out with their uh, rebel problem. So we'll go... Like that. Child lacks a guardian. We will send you off to get opinion. Oh, I clicked on the wrong one. I was looking through children opposed to looking through people to educate. No, I really would very much like not to run directly into a... Uh, this army. No, we want a revolt. Good. Get the gold for that guy. Uh, he didn't actually manage to get anything. We'll just execute him. You know what? We'll kill the peasants if he walks past us. That'll be fine. Hmm. Who are... What religion are... These are all Tengri? If we can get in here, that would be great. Just a little bit of land in there. Then they just broke free from Carpathia. At some point. Okay, so we got another 10 gold. As you've spent your efforts in trying to gain wealth and the amount of hours you spent sleeping has decreased because sleeping is not a profitable behavior. Wait. Oh. Damn, I became stressed because I won gold. So I lost fertility and health. That is not good. This child needs a guardian though. And he is going to be educated by us. Because he has got the genius trait. So let's see if and some actual good stats to go along with it. So we'll see what we can do. Um, okay, so we got an opinion bonus for some guy named Frederico. Fine. Not too bothered about that. I can hear what? I'm just checking what the supply line. I just thought supply would be better next to uh, like a river. I guess not. Hmm. Okay. As I have a, as I have difficulty distinguishing the handle from the blade of a sword. Oh, distinguishing the handle from the blade of a sword. I would rather delegate the troublesome task of handling the troops to my martial king, in zeal. If I give him this, I have a chance of losing martial, gaining, like losing stress, losing martial, and gaining opinion bonus. No, I'm fine. I don't need martial strength. Uh, Burgundy, don't care. Well, I'll invite them into the war if they want to join the war. Oh, they joined. Wow. Oh, well. We will enforce demands. Take this land, and we will just... Quite nicely give it away. We'll keep it for ourselves, actually. Reminder, future self, keep this land. Because, well, we're going to go over the vassal limit. So, let's double check. Why are these people... Alright, he's the guy we're trying to kill. And these are potential heirs. Yeah. Good. Anyway... 
thank you for watching. Next time we will continue our wars up here. We will probably go and attack England for a bit of land. Um, where are you? Ac Ugh. Oh my god. What happened to Denmark? Uh, Denmark fell apart. So actually scrap that. Next time we're going to go and attack this mess. I thought it was in vassal mode. Like in the vassal map mode. This is actually what it looks like right now. We can get so many provinces. Oh. Anyway. See you then. Goodbye.